Hi, Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> Say, I'm a good boy. Say, I should good boy today. Hi, you good boy. Yes, he is. I'm not bad no more. <laughs> You going where? Mm -hmm. You going to Jersey? Todd, say hi. Hey. <laughs> you going to Jersey? No. Where are you going? You going to go see your pop out today? Y'all yeah. waiting for the um UPS truck to get here because I'm expecting some packages. So I'm just sitting down here with my granddaughter and my grandson. So. Everybody just had lunch. Yo, Taja was falling out the chair, right? And my grandson went over to Taja. He gonna move the chair out the way and move the phone. Like, at least my chair good. I'm falling out the chair. It ain't something else. I'll tell you guys. Oh, This is my laundry room area, you guys. It's time for a laundry room refresh. I'm going to take everything down that I got mounted up here on the wall. I'm going to take the uh, wallpaper down, um, the curtains from the window. I'm just going to just, it's a small space, so it's not really that much I can do. But I am going to paint the walls the same color that I had in my kitchen. Um, I brought you guys along when I had did this, put the wallpaper up on this wall. I got a video when I had when I was doing this uh, makeover. Take everything so. down and get it together. I bought new curtains uh, for the window and I bought something else to go up there on that wall. I'm going to leave the door as is. Ain't no need to paint that door. But the shelf over there is going to be redone because it is white. And I'm going to wind up painting that as well. So, yeah, you guys. So, stay tuned for the transformation of my small little space. doing the things that I need to do for that area and I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Timu and what I got from Foreman Mills. This is me today. 
Just got a pair of leggings on, long sleeve top. It's still pretty cold outside. And I got my little beer paw ankle boots on that I got from Walmart a long time ago. So, yeah, let me go ahead and show you guys what I picked up today. Guys, before I start painting and getting everything together, um, I stopped past Foreman Mills. So, this is paper and all the pictures and items that i had in that laundry room got rid of all of that stuff and today i will be doing painting um i don't know how much of the painting i'm going to show you guys it's a small space so i could whip it in shape really really quickly but i wanted to go to foreman mills and get some things for the kitchen and um my laundry area so i am refreshing both areas but i'm just showing you guys the laundry area so let me show you what i got so I got these pretty turquoise uh, curtains, and they were $5.99 a panel, and this is the name, and this is how they look. These are absolutely beautiful. Y'all know blue is one of my favorite colors, and this color right here, it's like a, I don't know, I ain't going to say turquoise. I'm going to say powder blue. That's what it looks like. It looks like powder blue curtains. Um, I don't see the name on it, but they were $5.99 and I bought four because I do have one large window in there. And then I have like an area where you can hang your jackets and your coats at. And I usually put curtains in that area, make it look real nice. And I usually use another curtain from the entryway from the um, dining room into the kitchen. So this is why I bought four of those. Then I bought this cute embroidered sheer garment panel. I bought this right here for the laundry area. Okay, because the laundry area is going to have like creams and browns and like a yellow. Because the wall is um, painted summer. And, um, you know, you can't go wrong with, you know, like browns and yellows. Or you'll see it at this all put together. And this is what it looks like. I only needed one. So this was $5.99. Also, can't go nowhere without picking up some wax melts. And this was a new find for me. The Arm & Hammer uh, Neutralized Order and, freshen it, and Freshens the Air. And this is in um, Citrus Swirl. First time I actually seen Arm & Hammer make wax melts. And this was $1.99. Then I got another pack. And this is in Ripe Raspberry. So, yeah. That was really nice. And these were the only two cons that I saw there. Um, they might they had room because they might have had more, but they sold out. But if I'd have seen more, guess what? Your girl would have bought more. So I only spent a total of uh I spent a total of thirty two twenty eight with tax two seventy two. So the total came to thirty seven dollars. Which is not bad for all these items right here, you know? For five packs of curtains, this is not really, it's not bad. Okay, you guys, and this is the rest of the items that I got from Tamu right here. Let me open this box up right here. Okay, you guys, I got this uh, bacon, this bacon tin can right here. Y'all know how y'all make bacon. That pork bacon is so flavorful. You could use that grease, put it in. It could, it could season up your whole pot of greens, your green beans, even beans. If you ain't got no smoked meat or nothing to put in your um, in your beans or whatever, your your vegetables and you cooking, save that bacon grease. I remember my mom used to get that bacon grease and she had like a little can on the stove and be like don't bother that i got my grease in there <laughs> i'm just like a so anyway i got this cute little can it's a bacon grease it has a little the strainer part in there and it also has the lid i thought this was really really nice and i will be leaving this on my stove okay so i got that next up i got this cute little floor mat let me open it it says laundry room open 24 hours. I thought this was so cute. But you guys know that it's like a little floor mat. But I'm not going to use mine for a floor mat. So y'all have to stay tuned and y'all see what I'll do with this. Up next, another floor runner. And this says self-service, 25 cent, loads of fun. Laundry room open 24 hours. It say drop your drawers here <laughs> drop your drawers here <laughs> that 
This is so nice. And also, this is not going on the floor. I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to do with this. Now, this laundry mat right here, this one will be going on the floor. We have another one right here. I, oh, I hope and pray they both aren't the same size. Yeah, clipper, blade, oil. I got this to keep my um, blades nice and lubricant. I don't want my blades to get rusty or anything. And so I got this. She like it's a half a bottle. <laughs> okay, now back to the video. Moving too fast. Almost forgot about this. Okay, it says, you are my sunshine. They should have had this up a little higher. They cut it off too fast. Yeah, they cut it off too fast. But nevertheless, it's still nice for the you price. Guys, all the wallpaper is down off the walls, and these walls do need a coat of paint. And they look terrible. Oh my goodness, all painted the same color that I painted my kitchen, which is the color summer. And here's the paint right here. I got this paint from Habitat for Humanity, and it is recyclable uh, paint. So I am going to... I am mixing it up now. This is premium 100% recyclable latex paint. And it was $22. So yeah, guys, I'm just stirring up the paint right now. And I'm about to get started. As I get it good and stirred up. And I'll bring you guys back. Laundry room walls are done. I got to clean up around the window, finish painting the walls and everything. So yeah, y'all, I'll bring you guys back. So I don't want to throw away this bookshelf right here. I know it looks terrible, but I'm going to use this. It came out of my laundry room. I'm going to paint it and I'm going to put some contact paper so on it. This is the before. This is how it looks, guys. I still got to go over it with a little bit more paint. I just put it back in the spot that it that it belongs in. And once it gets dry, I'm going to go ahead and put some contact paper on it. So I'm going to bring I'll you guys back. So this is the way it looks now after the wallpaper came off and I painted. Well, I decided not to put the contact paper on the shelves because I ain't wanted to tear up the wood that's on there. So um, this is what I did so far. I got a... Uh, Bring you guys back. I'm going into my laundry area right here. And this is what it looks like, you guys. I don't want to blind y'all with that little neon sign I got right there. It's like a flower. I got it from Tamu. I'm going to cut it off because I don't want it to be extra, extra bright. But So, so this is what I did with the mats. I placed the mats on the wall. Okay, I got my little long plant right there. I got this mat right here. It says laundry room open 24 hours. I uh, got my little laundry uh, baskets right there. Here's on the other side. I got some more laundry things right there. And my little cleaning supply stuff is over here. Okay. And go around this way. Got my little yellow curtain up there. And I got the other mat right there that says self-service, 25 cent, loads of fun, laundry room, over 24 hours. Drop your drawers here. <laughs> That's cute. Drop your drawers here. And I got two pictures right there on the wall. I didn't want a whole lot of little teeny pictures in this laundry area because I wanted to just keep it nice and light and bright in here. And all the little pictures just makes it look too junky for me. And here's another little window right there. So, yeah, guys. So, this is what my little laundry room looks like. Even though the washing machines, they are made by the same makers. But they are different colors. So, I kept my silver, you know, this uh, stainless steel Samsung dryer. And I got this washing machine right here. And it's in black. Now, I could have got it in stainless steel, but I would have had to wait so long for like a back. It's like a back order. So, I took and got this one right here. I waited long enough for it. So, and I actually had got this delivered on Valentine's Day. So, and it's the top load. I got a load of clothes in there now that I washed. I couldn't wait. Okay. So, this is what it looks like. And also, I have my little 
mat right here on the floor that says laundry. And the other one is up top right there. So that's what it looks like when it's off. That flower right there. It was kind of blinding me. So <laughs> I said, I'm just cut it off. I like it for like the nighttime. And I'm down here doing laundry at night. And I'll go ahead and I'll light that back up. So yeah, y'all. So this is what I did here. I could have paint. I could have painted the ceiling, but I didn't feel like it. And so yeah, just as long as I got my little washing machine and my dryer, I'm good to go. All right. There's not no area in here where you can sit back and you can fold your clothes and all that. I don't have that, but I do have my laundry hampers, and um, just bring my laundry up with one of those hampers. So this is what it looks like, you guys. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until the next video, God bless. Be safe and stay prayed up. And have a nice day. Bye.